on 43% of their thirds. Hostler dropping back. The blitz is on, but he goes across the middle and it's behind the receiver. He was trying to go to Calvin Harris, who's kind of snuck out of the backfield. Incomplete pass on the Bowie defense, as tough as it's been all year. Tough on the first series. Pass a little bit behind Calvin Harris, who's an all-purpose guy as well, just a bit behind it. And then there was Sterling Grant Jones making certain he understood that this is going to be a long football Saturday. The Bowie secondary will absolutely tattoo you if you allow them to get to you. Come out with an eye formation. Tyshawn Gurley's the up back wearing 88. Richard Medlin, 22's in the tailback spot. Gurley's in motion. Flag is down, and so is Medlin. Big loss on first down back to the 15-yard line. 11 yards. It's a first down and five thanks to the penalty. Same formation, same looking play, but a bootleg action this time. Pass almost intercepted by Sterling Grant Jones. My goodness, that was close, Stan. The further the Hostler rolled back, the further the distance became. And you're trying to get the ball to Tyshawn Gurley, who I think they're going to try to implement in their offense a little bit today. And you can see he just fades and fades, fades a little pressure. And this ball is almost picked off Gurley. Not a great effort to try to get that football. Again, right now, I'm just, I'm a little concerned if I'm a Fayetteville State fan because our offense is not clicking. We're not. We're not smooth in any way, shape, or form. Two line bringing you all. Eden, you're not going to run very much against them. Just saw Kyle Jackson a moment ago, 54. He made the stop on that last play for the Bulldogs. A little down the line option. The pitches to Medlin. A lot of room over there. Closed off Sterling Jones for the Broncos. Need a play right here. Hoster dropping back. He's under some pressure. Got a man open. Goes across the middle. Sidney McCready had it in his hands, but he is absolutely undressed by Sterling Grant Jones. Oh, Didn't I just my. tell you guys that these defensive wow. backs would hit you if you give him a chance? I'm going to tell you what. He absolutely just popped him, and McCready is still on the field. And he may be there for a couple seconds. Pressure again on the quarterback. Just kind of floats this one up there. McCready's got his sights on the ball, but it doesn't matter because Sterling Grant Jones has got his sights on McCready. Hi out. My goodness. A lot of pressure there on Hostler, and he did kind of throw that up. But I tell you what, that is a pop. Mercy sakes alive. William Wall putting the pressure on Hostler. Hostler does a nice job of getting rid of the football, but McCletty didn't see the truck that hit him. We'll be back. An unbelievable pop from Sterling Grant Jones. Here it is again. On our Sterling Grant play. Jones is 5'11", 187 pounds. McCletty 6'4", 215. That's what happens when you collide in midair. Bang. Oh. McCletty on the field for a while, but then he got up and ran off the field under his own power. And that's great to see that. My goodness, because we were thinking there for a second. There's a guy that made the hit right there. Sterling Grant Jones, you take your helmet off now and let everybody see you for that one. He wants to get one of those little dog bones on the back of his helmet. <laughs> During the play. He, uh, you have been warned. All right, so it's third and short. Hossler rolling to his left. He's intercepted by Sterling Grant Jones, and it will be Bowie State football. And is Sterling Grant Jones having an unbelievable day? My goodness. Well, this is a poor throw by Tyler Haas. It looks like he just short arms it. They try to roll him out to get away from pressure and just indecisive in the throw. It's not a strong throw. Watch this. It's off the wrong foot. Floats it out there. Easy pick by a guy that can make some plays. Sterling Grant Jones, his first interception of the season. He made a pretty good run with it after he got it. Six yards on the return. And look where Bowie State is at the 46-yard line of Fayetteville State. In great field position. Second team all CIAA. He's got 44 yards on the play. Maybe that'll get Fayetteville going. They go to Medlin off the left side. But guess who's in the backfield? Sterling Grant Jones again. Left to play in this quarter, and, and, and got my favorite state team is averaging almost 30 points a ball game. Yet to get on the board, huge drive, very important drive. Down the line option, they pitch it to Medlin. Medlin runs right into Sterling Grant Jones. 
but he picks up a nice, nice play on the game. It's good when you come up with that. Uh, I stayed up late last night to, in case anybody had to ask me. It's important to find that kind of stuff out. Big third and seven inside screen. Medlin's got some room, but it closed up in a hurry. He's going to be short of a first down by a couple of yards, and I, I can't believe Sterling Grant Jones is in on the tackle along with Delano Johnson. I can because they're nasty and mean <laughs> linebackers. <laughs> Tell you what, Grant Jones is everywhere, so it'll be fourth down and little over two to go, so they'll bring on the field goal unit to attempt to hit a field goal. Now, if you remember earlier, Austin turned five for Fayetteville State, they only had 108 on the day, so this is a big drive here. Split backfield behind the shotgun quarterback of Hostler, just two wide outs as he drops straight back. Automatic, first down. Well, you definitely can throw a couple into the end zone now. You got plenty of time. Let's take a look and see if Grant Jones gets his hand. Yeah, you can see maybe just a second with the left hand. Yes, yeah, he's got his left arm around. The Two today. Williams throwing it out in the flat here to Kingdom Doe. Go running north and south and all the way down to about the 13, 14 yard line. Brought down by Sterling Grant Jones, but this is an impressive drive thus far by Fayetteville State. Very impressive, Williams in rhythm. Remember, this is a guy that started five of the football games this year, threw for 85 out of 149, had six touchdowns. In fact, he's still one of the top 10 quarterbacks in the CIAA. First down for Fayetteville. Tell me this doesn't get any quarterback excited. draw. I don't know. Blitz is coming again. Blitz is coming. He did a little better job of picking it up. Pass was tipped at the line of scrimmage, and it falls incomplete. That Sterling boom. Grant Jones making the play on defense against Jameer Pugh. The Bowie State defense always around the football. I love the guts of that. You know, Durante Jones just comes in as a defense coach and said, we're going to bring the house. you got to make a play to beat us. Pressure one more time. Bowie wow. State makes a defensive play. How many times is that Sterling Grant Jones or Embry have made deflections today? Let's keep the defense from substituting so many folks. Split backfield. And off to Medlin on a sweep to the right side. Strung out awfully well by the Bowie defense again. Sterling Grant Jones, one of the first folks to get the off today. And this is a big third down for the Broncos. Third and 20. Take the throw, money a draw play. Medlin knew there. In fact, he loses a yard, and that'll bring in the punt team. Austin Turner will come in to kick it away. And now maybe a flip of the field for Bowie State. Well, the defense is held in very good for Bowie. It's a nice tackle, Sterling Jones. 